huge misunderstanding. Yeah, sure made fools out of ourselves. Nothing new for you, Vector. What? You were the first one to jump at the chance. No time for arguing. Now's the time to be on guard. It's very mysterious around here. Yes, you got that right. So we need to find 10 keys. Right. I think the keys are around here. What? Where? Oh, so now I gotta say I got some good news. Um, I think the keys are around here. So today, thank you. Today the damn recording this. It's been what I think about a week. Since uh, Frontiers has come out, and I haven't really seen anything like I haven't really seen any reviews or anything to spoil it because I really just like I said, I really want to play the game for myself and whatnot. But at least from what I can gather, it seems like what I have nothing to worry about because Frontiers. Because Frontiers is apparently, uh, it's apparently, it, there's people who are saying it's a really good Sonic game. And you have no idea how happy that makes me, that makes me feel hearing that because, you know, it's like I talked about earlier, uh, like a while ago that people were really just hating on the game when the trailer first came out when I always had a feeling that or I always had hope that it was gonna be good and it looks like I'm my I was my hope was well placed so knowing that I'm really looking forward to playing Frontiers of course there you do have some people who just you know, hate who just hate on Sonic because I have seen some people review stuff saying that, oh, yeah, like this game sucks. Let's go. And you know, there's that one that one quote that everyone loves to throw out that, oh, Sonic's transition to 3D has always been rough. And I, I really hate that quote. You know, the, I feel like the people who really say that are the ones who never really played Sonic or a 3D Run. Sonic game because Sonic Adventure, I'd say it was a really good game for, um, it was a really good game for Sonic, you know, it's a really good 3D game, it transfers, it really takes what worked in, uh, the 2D Sonic games and go. makes it work in 3D. And then you have Sonic Adventure 2, which changed it up a bit, but it was it's really good. There's a reason why a lot of people regard Adventure 2 as one of the best Sonic games out there. Thank you. Yeah, people don't say it just to say it, you know? So I don't know. I feel like the people who always say that, who who use that dumb argument that Sonic's transition to 3D was was rough. I feel like they're just really talking out of their ass. They and that's the thing too. I think I feel like the people who often hate on Sonic games, who leave re like bad reviews and whatnot, probably have never played a Sonic game in their life, and they're just following they're just following the crowd when and saying that that uh, Sonic games aren't good because you know I felt like there was a time when that was just like the cool thing to do right just hate on Sonic now I'm not saying that Sonic doesn't have bad games of course he has his fair share of bad games but I just think people people who say that just really haven't played Sonic games, as there are really good 3D Sonic games out there. So they're either the people who've never played Sonic, 
or they're just letting nostalgia get to them as they grew up with like the 2D titles and they're just like, oh yeah, nothing is as good as the old days of Sonic. But, you know, it does seem like the general consensus is that Sonic Frontiers is a good game. Now, I don't know. Now, I'm assuming it's not perfect. But, you know, I'll take good. The last time we had a good mainline Sonic game was with Generations. And that was, what, like a decade ago? So, I'm... I'm glad, I'm glad to hear that. And when I say mainline, I mean 3D too, cause I know Mania came out, but you know, that's... That's just like, a compilation of like, I kinda see Mania as more of like a compilation of Sonic's greatest 2D hits. So, you know, I don't really count that. It, it's a good game, don't get me wrong. It's a really good Sonic game. But I'm talking about like 3D Sonic game, go. like a new 3D mainline go. Sonic go. game. Here we go. So with that, I can't wait till we finally get to uh, Sonic Frontiers. I'm really gonna be looking forward to it. It'd be nice if I could get. PlayStation 5 by then, because the, my only other option to get it right now is to either get it for the for the PC. Yeah, it's either to it's to either get it for the PC or the Switch, and there's no way in hell I'm getting the Switch version. I heard the Switch version just sucks. And I don't know. I, I've I've seen the specs. For for Frontiers, and I just don't think my PC will be able to run the game at like high settings at 60 FPS. So I might just have to settle for like maybe medium settings, uh, 30 FPS. But you know what? It's whatever. It's not a deal breaker, I would rather play the game in 60, but if I can't, oh well I can't. But hopefully I could get a PlayStation 5 soon, that'd be nice. I mean, getting a PS5 right now is a little tough for me, cause there's two things that are really stopping me from getting one. One is just the actually being able to acquire one since even though it's been what two years after it came out and it's still hard to like it's still hard to get one due to a shortage of place a ps5s available which oh i just realized we restarted the whole level so i'm missing two k two keys from the looks of it yeah so So with knowing or oh my god, this song. Yeah, so um Here we go. Here we go. Hmm, oh there's a flower here. Wait, did I even go through the flower the first time? I don't remember. Oh, no, I didn't, because I don't remember being here. Yeah, so, there's the issue of, well, getting. Hey, they're asleep, so stay quiet and move slow. Okay! What are you doing? Be quiet! Um... Yeah, I just think it's so crazy how two years after, and it's still hard to get a PS5. Like, they're Sony hasn't still isn't producing enough to make them readily available to the public. So that's the first. 
I guess that's like the first roadblock to me getting the PS5. The second would be money. Right now I just, unfortunately I don't really have a lot of money to, oh wow it was right here. Unfortunately I don't have enough money to, to get a PS5 because I want to get the, I want to get the disc version, not the digital version. Uh, even though I know the digital version is cheaper, but I don't know, there's just something about having discs like physical copies of games that I just really like. It just Not resonates bad. with me more. It makes me feel... I don't know. I don't know what's the word. But, yeah, I want to get the one with disk drive, which is... I know it's like $100 more. And that's another thing. I Because I, uh, I know when they came out, they were, what, six? it was like $600? So here we go. I'll take the lead. I just want to make sure if I could take out the torches with something else besides that spear. Okay, yeah, I need to use this leaf, this leaf tornado. Here we go. Yeah, it was six hundred, and I heard supposedly that Sony wants to increase the price of the PS5 now, which. I really hate that. Like, as if it wasn't already expensive. They want to make it more expensive. Oh, and that's another thing. I, I'm also waiting for them to release the uh, the pro version. Cause I heard I heard the pro was supposed to come out like in 2023. And I figured, well, I waited this long. I I might as well just you know get the pro version. Who knows? Maybe the pro version will come with will come with uh with the, with the graphics card equivalent to the RTX 4 uh, 40 series. I don't know. Hopefully, though, I hope uh, within a year I can get myself I can get my hands on the PS5. I, at this point, I feel like I'm one of the only people who, who don't have a PS5 or an Xbox Series X. And I mean, yeah, I do have a gaming PC, which is pretty. I mean, you know, PC will always be better than console, but unfortunately, my PC is not good enough. And it's not like I can upgrade my PC. It's not like it's a custom. It's not like it's a custom built PC. So, uh, you know, my option there is to just buy a better PC or just get a PS5, but I think the cheaper option is just getting a PS5 because if I want a PC with like the same specs as, uh, yeah, if I want a PC with the same specs as, uh, as the PS5 and Xbox Series X, I'm looking at a PC that will cost me at least double, uh, yeah, at least like double of what the what the consoles cost. So, you know, I might as well just spend my money on the console. I do want to, now I do want to eventually own, like build my own custom rig. But uh, I feel like that'll be down the line in a couple years when... I make more money because when I make my rig, I really want to go all out. I feel like if if I'm gonna get if I'm gonna spend money to build my custom rig, I might as well just go all out, you know. Get like the best stuff on the market. That way, I don't have to upgrade it for like a for a couple years. That'd be nice. But here's to hoping. Here's to hoping in 2023 I can hopefully get myself a PS5. I'll take the lead. Here we go. Oh shit. Here 
Here we go. I'll take the Let's lead. I'll take the lead. So why am I blowing up these blue flames if they don't count to it towards my thing? I hope I didn't miss. I just realized I really hope I didn't miss any um, flames. So what did that do? Alright. I think I have a feeling that would have sent me back somewhere. Let's go. Oh my god, I almost fell due to slipperiness. Here we go. I'll take the lead. All right, where do I go from here? Oh, don't tell me not to blow out that flame. Those statues must move using those switches. Here we go! I just realized that I have to blow out 60 flames. That's crazy. I feel like I'm gonna be here a while. And that's assuming that I didn't miss any, and the ones I'm blowing out are really getting blown out. This isn't working. We have to find a switch somewhere. There's something wrong here. I, mean, I don't mind as long as they're flames. Oh, I just found the switch. Will that open the door? I'm not sure. Alright, so it looks like we went completely around. Oh. I feel like these blue flames have to have some kind of purpose, you know? Alright, sounds like something just opened. Where are we now? Is there anything over here? Nope. Nice, alright, now I don't have to do that stupid leaf attack. Oh my god, I almost fell. I wonder if that'll actually even work. I see a crack right there. So it's so dramatic. I don't know what the hell that opened. Uh, of course. I should have. I sh should have seen that one. Here we go. I'll take the All right. Be a switch to open this door somewhere. Here we go. Man, I really hate these flying switches. They're just so hard to like Who knows hit. What happen if you trigger this switch. Tell me I didn't miss any more. This is the issue with this mission. It takes a long ass time just for this reason. Oh man. Here we go! 
I think that's the issue with uh, with this robot. I can't take it off this helmet as easily with Espio. Anytime you're ready. He's gonna keep doing this. Oh man. No, oh, he almost died. I'll take the lead. Here we go. Oh, what the hell? Let's go. I think that's weird that that light just came on when I touched it. Yeah, I feel like this this level takes quite a while to complete for this reason. Just because there's like 60 of these that you need to find. And it looks like the blue flames don't really count to that. Here we go! We will, let me just take out these things. is the way I didn't even see that shadow right there Nothing there. Let's go. It's a giant spider web. Should we grind on it to cross over? Oh man, this just looks like it's gonna be crazy. Careful not to fall. It's really dangerous here. I really hate these spider web grind rails. Let's go. Here we go. There must be a switch to open this door somewhere. They don't tell me go. it's the blue flame. Here we go. I do see Let's more go. torches here. Now, there's no way I'm getting a time bonus for this. I'm not even gonna bother with those blue flames in the middle. I'll take the lead. Let's go. Oh man, why is there lasers here? I need to get out of there. Okay, how the hell? Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. How the hell am I supposed to touch this thing? Oh my god. Let's just team blast here just so we can get some rings. Let's go 
down there. Is there anything up here? No. I sense something. What are you thinking about? Oh my god. At least there's only like 10 more left. But I got the feeling we're already heading towards the end of the stage right here. When I see the um flower right there that just that just tells me oh yeah we're pretty much at the end and we're gonna go all the way back you'll see oh i guess not all right well i see that one up front and it really doesn't inspire a lot of confidence i'll say that Especially because there's one of those big armored dudes there. Here we go. Yeah, I do think this is the end because those two will make this 50. What is it? 56. And then. That means there will be four left to find. You know what? I don't even know why I have to fight this guy. I could just ignore him. Here we go! I'll take the hit. Whoa, back at the beginning, huh? Yeah, I knew it. Alright, so that means we missed four. Yeah, you know what? I gotta say, I remember this mission. I remember doing it when I was younger. I kind of forgot what it was like, but this brings back memories of how much I hated it. Oh yeah, like there's two right here. I remember how much I hated doing it because it took so long. I mean, I feel like 60... I feel like 60 torches to take out is a bit overkill. Especially when there's exactly... It seems like there's only exactly... Uh, there's nothing down there, right? I see something down there. Oh, but I can't go down there. There's like a fan that's blowing me up. Yeah, when there's exactly 60, yeah, that's even more annoying. Like I said, I have no idea where the last two could be. Does that have to do with this? So well, that's the thing, this thing like, literally leads to nowhere. And then if I try to activate this flower, nothing happens. It really gave me a team blast just for that. Another blue flame, so I don't need those. I better not die. I just, I just realized I don't even know when the last checkpoint was. Here we go. But I got the feeling it's been a while. Here we go. And this is crazy. I should not be in this Sonic stage for 18 minutes. That's just crazy. I bet you it's here. Why do I have the feeling it was like right here? Yeah, I remember this... Like when I did this mission in the past, like this hallway being like a place where I often missed... Yeah, where I often missed the torture too. Alright. So it's not here. And none of these doors open. Here we go! I'll take the lead! 
Here we go. I really hope that flame doesn't isn't like a key or something. Oh yeah, I just found them. How did I miss those? Man, you just you just really don't pay attention, huh? I'm gonna get like an E just because I took way too damn long. What? Perfect. What? I got an A even though I spent 20 minutes in the stage? That is crazy. Keep in mind, I got no time bonus. I feel like the time bonus like is what really determines your grade. It, it isn't like everything. But I feel like if you don't get a time bonus, you you can you really are, forget about getting an A. He's the one, right? This is gonna cost you extra. <laughs> that was weird. There was something strange about the card. Don't worry about it. We've got to take care of this guy first, Freddy. I'm telling you I got spotted by that six shot. Alright, let's see how hard Team Chaotix uh, Robot Storm is. If it's harder than Team Chaotix. Oh wow, look at that. Oh, you got charm new max level. Please don't tell me I wasted that. I just realized. I just remembered. I need to be careful with my team blast with team uh, with robot storm. Alright, let's just use it, why not? Let's just do this. Whoa! I feel like Team Chaotix is uh... Team Blast is the reason why rings don't count for uh... Yeah, why they don't count towards bosses. Wow, there's three of them right here. I'm not sure if it's just me, but I really feel like Team Chaotix's is Team Blast um, replenishes much quicker than every other team. Oh my god. Oh my god. Cause look at that, you saw my bar, it was already almost like maxed out. Oh wow. Now I see why it wanted me to do that. What? 
What was that? Oh my god! There was something strange about the car. Don't worry about it! We've got to take care of this guy first, Rick! Slow up! I have no idea what that bullshit was. You know, I'm thinking maybe if I could try to use a team blast on those robots so I don't have to deal with them. I don't have to risk whatever bullshit happened there. Oh my god. I think if their if their team blast really replenishes that quickly, I might just keep spamming team blast as much as I can. It'd be dumb not to. Thank you. Hey, you see, look at that. I already have another one ready to go. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, there we go. Man, I'm just glad they get their team blast replenished go. so quickly. Speed run right here. There we go. Awesome. All right, let's try this. See if it works. Oh, it actually didn't work. What the hell? All right. Well, yeah. It looks like I'm gonna have to do this. No. Oh my god! I almost just killed myself doing that. All right. I better not die. I feel like I really have to time my shot. Which it goes without saying, it, you have to do this part with the power character because the power character are the only characters that let you um, manually aim the cannon. With every other formation, you just, uh... Oh man, I missed that one. With every other formation, you just basically... Miss. Or it, it automatically aims for you, and it's not like it's gonna necessarily aim... Aim at the... Enemies.
Come on. Oh my god, I'm just like a little too slow. I like how to anticipate its movement. There we go. to the final arena. Oh, there's a lot of them here. Look at that, 598 rings. That was just so damn crazy. Yeah, they would have added the ring thing. Or they would have added rings towards like character, like, bo like boss scores. It would be so broken for Team Chaotix just for this reason. Alright, looks like that was the end. Roger. So we're done with Team uh, Robots. Thank you. Did he really think he could stop us oh, with man, that? Oh man, a C.